Hello guys, this video we will talk about Raider Modern Strike campaign Act 1 to Act 4 We will focus talk about uh, Act 1 to Act 4 because after Act 4 we usually unlock all skill gems we need First I want to talk about leak mechanic like accents like and ha, the battery, it help you a little bit when you are very early on the lake. In Act 2, you will meet and ha, so you just help him to kill the beast. And you click right here on your way waypoint. And you come to the blood altar. So it sometimes give you some currency crafting, some jewel, some jewel ops, some chromatic op. It help you a little bit. And you're lucky enough, you may get a recipe to craft a unique items. It also help you a little bit when leak start. So I will suggest you to do every leak mechanic you meet. It will give you some reward and it help you a little bit, a little bit and and become more and more. You don't have to kill everything not necessary. Like like sometimes you will meet a rare monster. It's very tanky. It take long time to kill. So what you need is run the campaign as fast as possible. And here's the vendor recipe I want to share to you. Any weapons with the rustic stash and also one bad stone. If the belt is a magic, magic rarity, you get tier 8 increased physical damage. If you sell with the rare Rare belt, it will get tier 7, increase physical damage. So after that, you can craft attack speed on it, or you can just augment it with random modify outcome. Another way to upgrade our weapons, we can use whatever essence we found and just use on the weapons. And we can just craft a low low rank flat damage. If you Doing a coal build, you can craft coal on it and physical the low low rank, right? The physical you can craft on it. So this is another options for you. And when you reach the part two, you might starting to die a lot, and you have to check your resistances. Like you got forty three percent fire resist, you just coming back here and and you can craft some fire resist on your gears and also you can craft some strength or any attribute you need and also check the shop always when you need the socket link like this one is not bad right you can do your whirling blade faster attack and left tap and i will explain a little bit socket color right here i know it's like a bullshit right but i i hope will help somebody don't know for example you need two red socket and two green socket you probably want to get armor base and evasion base if you start modern strike with rider you need to create a marauder first and after the first quest, you get into the base, you get the modern strike reward and you get back to the rider and you start the leg starter. So this is the note what gem you need and what you should use on every act and what level you should you have to change your gems. The skill setup is very basic so I don't talk about it uh, very detailed right here but you the, the quest right here at the act three from the library is very important for us we need to buy a bunch of skill gem right here like uh, we need to buy protector right here so ancestral protector we need to buy concentrate effect right over here and also we have to buy flame dash right here so after we got our flame dash we can set up our mobility skill faster attack rolling blade and life tap support with the rolling blade, they will be more and more confident to use the skill. So you have to buy a lot of gems from this guy. If you missing some gems, you will come to come right here to buy this. So you just follow the gem setup. I will list on description below. It will be very easy to 
follow. So this is a path of building. It will be on description below and you can follow it one by one. And also you can just get whatever you want first. Like I just get all attack first and I just get life uh, at behind. But if you think you want to play more safe, you can get life first. And after that you go going to get critical strike. Uh, critical strike is up to you. It's never mind. It still be work. And the end game versions you can check out by channels uh, on these videos. We got many end game versions on on the on these videos. You can check out the descriptions, and it got many end game versions, budget versions, uh, very greedy versions, many projectile versions. Every version you can find right there. Um. Yeah, doing a leak start, doing a leak starter video is hard, and I have no experience. I'm a little bit regret, but by the way, is a yeah, is a very nice experience for my career, and I hope I can do better next time. Maybe I won't do it again. <laughs> so this is the video today. And I will plan to stream every every day. You know, if you got any questions or you got interesting about the build or you got interesting about me, you can visit my stream. I will stream every day. And yeah, see you guys. Good luck with your starter. Goodbye.